Club, Tafadali. Thank you, thank you. Next, we'll move to the tributes. And at this point, I would like to invite Professor Fred Were, who will speak on behalf of the friends uh, of the family. Professor Fred Were, to speak on behalf of uh, friends of the family. Welcome. Let me take my breath first, Excellency, uh, President of the Republic of Kenya, Excellency, the First Lady of the Republic of Kenya, allow me to say all other the protocols observed. So I salute to the fam primary family, uh, Eileen, Joy, Lana, and the little one. <sighs> Michael, both a friend and part family, but bigger friend even than family. I first met uh, the general about 45 years ago, when he was a 17 year old, young man, battling to go to high school, what we called high school then. Uh, I had met him because I was dating his cousin, who was sitting next to me there. So I sort of joined the family from then. I could speak for too long, but I'll just make one short remark about Francis. Francis was dedicated to everything that he did and measured everything that he did as well. Francis and I regularly sat to have a glass of wine or two. He would take one glass when I take six because he had control of things better than myself. He would not try to stop me, but he would very controlled. Francis to his death never came late for a social meeting, let alone the serious ones that uh, uh, His Excellency would require him. I can assure you that even the little Matt, some years ago as the Dean of the School of Medicine, University of Nairobi, then a gentleman very well dressed came and sat outside. I didn't know because I'm inundated with the people, people's issues. So my secretary came and said, there's a very well-dressed fellow here. Who says he'll wait his time? I said, does he have a student with him? He said, no, he's alone. I said, okay. Knowing how long it took me with my students primarily, he said, let me come and pull out this well-dressed gentleman. It was my brother-in-law. And he had come to plead for some, one thing that he is in the Air Force. He's not having enough doctors trained into specialists, pediatricians like me, surgeons. What can I do? I told my brother-in-law, we call it Mukhwas in my language, the other side, or Ora in Kijaluo, that you bring them. The purpose of this national university is to train. And if I love to train for the armed forces, that's the best thing I would do. Permit me to leave it there, because you know, there's a list of people who have a thing or two to say. But I, 